，唯一的朋友是沉默。有很多话儿对你说。How'd you feel? About fifty. You sleep well? No. Is it worth it? Yeah. <laughs> Beautiful again. <laughs> we packed up camp and started the trek back down from the wall. We'd only been there a short amount of time, but there was definitely something special about the place, amplified by how peaceful and beautiful it was. Breakfast. Hold it. Hold it. Refueled, we started the drive back to Beijing. We were tired and we were ready for a shower, but we were also eager to start exploring the city. In fact, when we checked into our hotel, we got a sudden burst of energy. Hiya. Hi. This is our bed. Our traditional. Courtyard room hotel. Nice. Oh, oh. <laughs> quite nice. I'll be definitely doing that. For lunch, we had some hot water with flowers floating in it and some deep-fried fish. It wasn't quite what we thought we'd ordered, but you know, it did the job. Mm. Oh. Next stop, Beihai Park. A thousand years old, it is one of the oldest imperial gardens in China. And if there's one thing the Chinese know how to do well, it's use a park. As we were to find out over the course of our trip. <laughs> Parks here are an important part of daily life. They actually became one of the highlights of our trip, as you'll see. Good afternoon, roof pigeons. After a quick pit stop back at the hotel, we headed out on a mission to find some dumplings. Your dumpling? <laughs> it was already getting quite late and the bars were starting to shut, but we managed to find a few that still had some life in them before we headed back. Overall, it was quite a gentle afternoon and a nice introduction to the city. But we had a busy day planned for tomorrow as we planned to explore the Forbidden City.